this isn't the best time, but I have something to say. Please forgive me. I've been a spy for Lord Melchior. You were the one telling the Abbey about us? Yes, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Melchior is a clever one, isn't he? Planting his spy right next to Magilu. After all, a forest is the best place to hide a tree. Melchior used his arts to place orders on Bienfu that overrode Magilu's pact. <sighs> that son of a dog. <laughs> Please don't hate me! I meant Melchior, not you. Really? Exerting control over someone else's life goes against everything Aizen stands for. We know you were forced to do it against your will. But my spying put everyone in serious danger. That's still a fact. The Bloodwings also knew what we were up to. What'd you tell them anyway? Um, uh, that Velvet is actually pretty good wife material? And what fishing rods Aizen prefers? And what Miss Mogulu says in her sleep? And how fast Dial's tail regrows? What? That's what you told them? It's done. Pay it no more heed. All right. How? Eleanor, I apologize for suspecting you. I'm sorry. Aizen? That's right. I must apologize as well. I'm deeply sorry, Lady Eleanor. Very well. Apologies accepted all around. First they robbed the Malachim of their will, and now their bodies too. Makes me sick. But still, it fits their reason. They want strength, and no art can squeeze... So, you all got away. It was all I could do to flee. I have lost face. You don't have a face! Uh, I was so scared. It's okay now, dear. I won't let them cause you any more pain. M Medissa was the one who saved us. Thank you. I could never forgive them for involving children. That's all. Kuragane, head to the rear docks. Keep them safe. If you find the prince and Griffin, take the Von Eltia and escape. As you wish. Roguro, take the Storm Quell. I made it with the Orichalcum you gave me. You actually did it? I abandoned all desire and forged it with a clear mind. You will find no harder sword in all the world. Storm Quell. I'll use it well, Kurogane. using armatization aware that it could cost them their lives? I'm sure they are. Endangering one's own life in order to save the many? It's the logical choice. But using something that dangerous so frequently in battle is absolutely wrong. The Abbey must be starting to feel the pressure, too. Even so, the losses are unacceptably high. That's how badly they want the Therians, and how big a threat we represent. Or it could be that it has nothing to do with us, and the real point is to test their new weapon. That can't be. A blade proves its true worth by making it through battle unbroken. Are exorcists all that different? Your logic is sound, but it's still awful. We were able to survive this time, but it won't be much longer until they've perfected the armatization. That's not the only thing we need to worry about where ticking clocks are concerned. Am I wrong? It. it doesn't matter. We kill whoever gets in our way. Managed to avoid capture, huh, Prince? As did you. You did well to avoid Artorius and his forces. Lord Artorius is here? He is. 
I overheard some exorcists mention it. Artorias. If you want to die, do it alone. We're saving the Therians before anything else. Besides, we're so close to deciphering the ancient book. I know. We'll escape from the rear docks. Follow me. Watch out, Princey Wincy. You ain't no Therian. If Griffin gets there first, we're leaving you behind. Uh, understood. use an armatus as well? I don't know. It's hard to believe that the Avi's leader would risk using an art that could end his own life, but... The Shepherd's reputation would be ruined if he self-destructed over some botched formula. On the other hand, if the risk is based on the user's ability, then the Legates might not have any trouble. So if Arturius were to try, he'd armatize with Inominat. Can an Empyrean be used as an armatus? He'll do it. Why else would he try to revive Inominat? But we're talking about an Empyrean! He'll succeed. I'm certain of it. This is the Shepherd Artorius we're talking about here. Whether God or Devil stands in his way, he won't be swayed. That's who he is. Velvet! But it won't save him. Bison, there's trouble. The enemy found the Von Eltia. Several enemy ships are heading this way right now. Set sail, now! I'm, uh, glad we were able to save everyone. There's no escape, Lord of Calamity! Benwick, forget me! Take the Von Altia and leave, now! That's madness! What do you think you're doing? If I don't take them down, they'll sink you from afar! Raise anchor! We'll make it through somehow! Aye, aye. But don't die. You hear me? Crazy kids. We're not going to die. We're going to kill. Head to the front docks. To steal an Abbey ship, I take it. That's where the Abbey's main forces will be concentrated. And Lord Artorius should be there too. All the better. But we still don't have a way to fight Enominot. I told you, if you want to die, do it alone. I'm not asking you to come with me.
Use me. Percival. Don't worry. Griffin got away. If you use me as a hostage, you should be able to steal a ship. I owe you one for this. But don't expect gratitude. I don't. Looks like this is our best and only bet. <laughs> We're going to the front docks to escape. Don't forget that. I know. Arthur's first maxim, right? About this whole hostage thing, you mean? Yeah, that too. But Velvet's acting really strange. And that's unusual how? Moggy Lou! Yelling at me won't change anything. Her thirst for blood knows no bounds. And she's got all the self-control of a wounded beast. With the way she's acting, I'm not sure she'll be able to escape. She's cut her way through all her problems before. She can do it again. I hope so. But everything has its limits. There's no blade that will not break. Nor is there such a heart. When the time comes, you'll need to make a decision. When the time comes... Well, looks like we shook off our pursuit. Of course we did. This is the Von Eltia. No, it can't be. This is terrible. Turn back, now! What? There's no way we can do that. I finally deciphered the last part of the book. If what it says is true, then you know me not is already... is clear all right let's make a break for the docks <laughs> you're running <sighs> it's lord artorius and <laughs> no stop please Now's the time to negotiate for safe passage. Step back, your highness. The girl before you wants nothing other than to kill me. You better believe it! <laughs> this is a trap. We're leaving. Let me go! I have to save her! That ain't gonna happen, kid. Don't forget, you're my ticket out of here, too. Try to stop me and I'll take you down! Even you, Aizen! <laughs> Your Armatus isn't gonna stop me! Don't worry. I have another trick up my sleeve. <laughs> that sword. Is that our Calcum? Good job, little bro. Never seen that before. Damn right! The hardest sword there is! It may be made of orichalcum. But still... <laughs> Tom, stand down, Shiki. Don't be a spoil sport. I'm just starting to have fun. 
Get caught in the middle of this, and even you won't survive unscathed. The one to face Velvet will be in Nomenot. Sister, did you miss me? Luffy! Velvet's brother? So that's his game. That's right. I am Lafayette Crow. And more. I am also Empyrean Inominat, the Suppressor. No. That's... Inominat? If you're gonna do this, you gotta commit! He's our enemy! I know! This is just... just another illusion! I'll devour all of you! Velvet, that's what you've been doing this whole time. Struggling against all reason. Shut up! Don't you dare! Pretend to be my brother! Your struggles are over. All your pain, your suffering, I'll end all of it for you. Is this... the power of an Empyrean? Exactly. This boy is Empyrean in Nominat the Suppressor. But how? We took away his strength! By kidnapping the Therians? Sorry to burst your bubble, but you were a wee bit late. It was never about the amount of malevolence the Therians devoured. What we needed to awaken him was eight different types. Greed, conceit, lust, cowardice, selfishness, obsession. Those six Inominat had already obtained by the time you managed to tear the Therians away. That leaves just the two that Velvet carries inside her. Once Inominat has them, he will fully awaken. And I don't even need an Earth Pulse for that. I can eat them right here. I tell you, Will! If you're that weak, stay out of my way. <laughs> Ow. It's all... an illusion. That hurts, Velvet. Shut up! Shut up! Are you going to kill me, sister? <laughs> Go away! Go away! Go away! Velvet, it was always so hard for me. I was so frail. All I did was cause you trouble. Is that why? Is that why you wanted me to go away? I never wanted you to go. I wanted you to live. I wanted you to be by my side. But in the end, I couldn't protect you. All I could do was offend you. <laughs> to get my vengeance, I... I devoured. I killed. 
Of course you did. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Luffy. It hurt, didn't it? Fee! Kill him, please! But... please? It's Luffy said! He's... he's my brother! <gasps> but Velvet... I never wanted you to avenge me. I mean, it's that sort of selfish emotion that creates malevolence, that creates the demons. What? That's why I'm going to help Arthur. We're going to make all the pain in the world go away. Including that hate, that ugly malevolence in you. Ugly... Malevolence? The awakened Inominat will suppress all negative emotions. He will remake humanity into beings free from sin. You take away all their sins and people aren't people anymore! I think that's just what they intend. Like how they steal free will from the Malachim. It will be a peaceful world, free from pain. So your goal this whole time was to rob people of their free will? If even an exorcist like you can let your emotions tempt you to betrayal, clearly it is the only way. I'll make this world a safe place free from demons. That has always been my dream. Don't worry. My wounds will heal. Once I have eaten you, sister. Because of what you've done that I need to make amends. You've hurt so many people, and all for nothing. You can't... Luffy! Fortunate. But they're within me now. I'll find them. A weapon can't just be hard, you know. It's got to be flexible, too. Or it'll snap. If you're addressing me, do you care to test that out? Nah. I think I'll wait on that. At least until you and Inominat finish up your armatization. Shepherd Artorius! What have you done?! It's all according to my plan, Your Highness. Let us return to the capital. What just happened? We were eaten by an Earth Pulse. This happened to you before, didn't it? It's different this time. It looks like our awakened friend Inominat is using the land as his vessel. In other words, this Earth Pulse is now part of his body. I was able to flee him only because I found a rift in the Earth Pulse as it formed. So... Velvet and the others! I guess I won my bet. Took long enough. Bravo! You do have a talent, if nothing else. Oh, Melchior. If you're here, this place must be more important than I suspected. Move aside. I must close this Earth Pulse Rift. Protect the rift! 
do well, and I'll forgive that little betrayal of yours. But if you run, my curse will follow you for eternity. You got it! It looks like I just won my bet. If I let you seal this rift now, I'll never collect. Illusions won't work on me. You can't break a heart that's already broken. That day, I interrupted my art when your heart broke. I suppose I was taking pity upon my student. But this time, know that I won't hold back. I will grind your heart into dust! <laughs> Glad to see you're okay. It looks like we got sucked into the Earth Pulse. Are you alright, Eleanor? What about everyone else? I'm fine. But... Kill. Kill. They killed... so many. Murdered. Slaughtered. It was all for him. I killed for... him. But he said I was... ugly. Nothing. <laughs> nothing. All for nothing. I can't. I have to kill. Die. Die. <gasps> the whole time, she... You're awake. Come on, we're leaving. I have to kill them. But he know me not as your... It's just an illusion! A fake! A trick! Or... What if it was really him? Then that means he betrayed me, doesn't it? You think I can't kill a traitor like him? Why? Why wouldn't I? Just how many do you think I've killed? You! Who watched me do it! I'm... sorry... Velvet! Fluffy, time to wake up. I told you to stop calling me Luffy. I'm not a little kid anymore. <laughs> grumble, grumble, huh? You must be feeling good. I'm afraid. No, this is Nothing different. Uh, today. A vision of the but past? Then, you stay in bed. Ah! <gasps> See? I killed him! It was easy! I'm used to it by now. Alright, we're getting out of here! With your power! But... NOW! We've gotta find Aizen and the rest! I said no! Enough! Stop it! They're the ones who need to be stopped! Isn't that right? I'll kill them. I'll kill them all! You must calm down. Fine. I'll calm down and look for an exit. That's what you want, right? Oh. Whatever the case, we have to get out of here. Let's keep moving for now. Yeah. I guess so. <laughs> 